Welcome back to the Baja Trip Series, and let's get on to day four. Look at that. Look at this place. All right, so apparently there's a really beautiful beach on the other side of the hill, but they closed the entrance to it right there. I guess the beach is maxed out for the day. It's only nine o'clock too, so dang, people must really want to see that. But beach is maxed out, so my cousin got the great idea to hike around it. She claims we can go up somewhere around there and then walk all the way down. Ready? This looks like it's gonna be a long, Are you long, a long hike. Oh yes, once again. This is why I love going with locals. Well, I guess you're not a local, but with people who know the area. I'm not a local, I'm a local. <laughs> <laughs> I see two people, actually, that reassures me. Right as we were getting ready to climb up this trail, I don't know if it was park rangers or park security, but somebody intercepted us and told us, hey, you can't climb up this trail, it's not an actual trail, plus there still isn't any beach access from this side. Yeah, 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 atrás. Yeah, 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 atrás. Nada más la vista. Oh. We were pretty bummed out, but we decided, you know what, let's just head back into town, figure out something else to do, and as we were headed back, oh my goodness, we found a hidden gem. Look at that. Oh my. Hey. Once again, we were intercepted by security, and I gotta say, I'm impressed with their team. They came out to us on kayaks this time, but they told us that the water was protected, so we couldn't really swim there, which we understood, and we got out. Gracias, perdón por, el, por esto. Before we left the area, though, I wanted to see if I could fly the drone and get a view of the beach that we were missing out on, and as if getting stopped by land and kicked out by sea wasn't enough, as I was flying, the bird started to attack my drone. Dude, what could they be doing there? Selling drugs? Like, they even got the birds to kick us out of the sky. That is the most impressive, impressive security team I've ever seen in my life. The most well-guarded nature place I've ever seen, ever. Good for them, though. Clearly, we weren't wanted there. So we headed back into town. Quiero un dos arriba y un cerro que se... Cerro, un cerro. We'll see if I pronounce that right. All right, well, this isn't the haircut I expected. He left it a little longer on top than I wanted him to. But you know what? We're in Mexico. Let him do his thing. Whatever, I'll take it. Kind of just left that there. That's okay, though. Whatever. We're in Mexico. Might as well try something new while we're down here. After squandering all my newfound free time getting a haircut, we headed back on the road to complete not only the longest drive of our journey, but also the most beautiful one. I can't think of a cooler place that I've seen. Maybe there's not much to do here, and maybe it's kind of boring other than just like looking around. But just straight up sightseeing, just straight up views. Oh my God, that was immaculate. Wow. <laughs> no. Wait, your, so your, your name would be El Chiquito. El Chiquito. Okay, I thought, guys, I thought that means My little, turn. which it does. Okay? But, I guess the way I said it to some dude, I said it like, like, as if I was talking about <laughs> Is that right? Yeah. yeah. Gusto El Chiquito. I even said, I liked El Chiquito. Yeah. I liked the. Yeah. He said, me gusto El Chiquito. Mm -hmm. Muy divertido. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, arran lo arranqué. Oh, that's so bad. I can't keep this. I cannot keep this. Si, perfecto. My cousin just asked to fill up a water jug with gas. Okay, because you want to charge your, your stuff. You're right, that is true, that is true. <laughs> Only in Mexico. I love though how everyone's just kind of so chill with everything. They don't question anything. They're just like, yeah, sure, you want your gas in a water jug? So, okay, let's do it. <laughs> Kimchi. Kimchi. 
Perrito, perrita. 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 We just got stopped by the military. They always check us. They always check our stuff. I think it's because we look young, huh? And they're like, yeah. what the hell are these guys doing they're out here? To be trafficking. Yeah. Well, I didn't expect to be doing this ever in my life. Camping in Mexico? Yo! Oh, land at last. Oh my God. We're literally right next to the beach. And everyone out here is having a good time. Look at that. What? Mine? How? With what? The cooler one. Cooler. Are you kidding me? Oh no. Oh no. Guys, their sleeping bags are soaked because our cooler, where is our cooler? Started leaking. No. The cooler got my bag as well. Half of my clothes is soaked, but that's okay. Because we got everything in the car drying out right now. Check that out. The sleeping bags, we got clothes over there, clothes over here, clothes right there. We literally look like we live out of this car right now. <laughs> I mean, I guess we're kind of doing it today. At least you know, the worst comes to worst. We got this. We can live in a car. <laughs> yeah, for real. Voila, we have our tent. Check it out. I mean, it's going to be a snug little fit with all of us, but it's okay. We gotta make do with what we got. The last time I went tent camping, um, we ended up not having the sticks for the tent and had to hang it from a tree. That's fine. And that was thanks to this girl. She had taken the tent out right before we did and she forgot to put the sticks back. <laughs> I didn't even think I had all the sticks. Oh, no, maybe not, huh? <laughs> Dude, you made a... You made a pregnant lady sleep in a messed up tent. How does that make you feel? She shouldn't have gone camping. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly though, that made the trip more fun. We had nothing else to do, so hanging a, hanging a tent from a tree was kind of a fun experience. Oh, I didn't even know you brought this. Look at that, what are you whipping up? Soup and what you Soup, oh my god, and not some bread. No, not for me, I got You're ceviche. Not You're not yep. Still trying to eat healthy while on this trip, so. Got some ceviche, and then, to add volume to this meal, got some cucumbers. Look how big this one is. Amy. <laughs> Amy. That was uh, a gift for you. <laughs> a gift, Para thank chiquito. you. For a chiquito. For a chiquito. Want my big cucumber? Oh my gosh. <laughs> this doesn't even look like a cucumber. No? Okay, don't take the fork. Oh yeah, hell no, this is going to take forever. <laughs> I can't even bite through this thing. And how sus did that just look? I'm all... <laughs> <laughs> did this man really feel the need to do what he did to that cucumber? Not once, but twice? Dude, you're acting weird, my boy. If there's something you gotta tell us, just tell us. It's 2022. It's alright. Are you doing something weird to Dude. the cucumber? <laughs> Dude, I just got caught in 1080p. Thank really? God this is in 4K. Thank God. <laughs> I know, I'm gonna take tiny bites now. What did the cucumber do to you? You cucumber molested. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. I'm so sorry. Let <laughs> me just sat on you. Your ass is too close to my face. <laughs> my fault. Guys, this has been one of the coolest trips Here. I've ever had so far. It's hot than we're having pizza when you bet she's an oats. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> At that point, we began winding down, started to get ready for bed. Our sleeping bags luckily did dry out, um, so we were able to use them, ended up being super comfy in them. But I actually wasn't even planning on vlogging that day. I thought it was just gonna be a drive day, so I'm glad I did take the clips I ended up taking because truly I was just gonna be like, you know what, let's just drive, hang out today, chill. But a lot happened, so I'm glad I decided to bring out the camera and get the clips I did. Anywho, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace!